Here's why we think a long wheelbase four-doored 2024 Ford Mustang could work as a revived Crown Victoria. Although it's been more than a decade since its retirement, the Ford Crown Victoria's legacy still lives on. As a favorite cruiser for many police departments, the Crown Vic was also a big, comfy, full-sized sedan capable of providing reliable private car service along with being a family hauler. It chugged along for many years and many miles. 11 years later, the sedan market is shrinking rapidly, especially full-sized luxury sedans. Ford doesn't even currently make a sedan, but that could all change as the 2024 Ford Mustang enters production. That is, if Instagram artist JLord8 has any say in it. With the new 4th gen Coyote V8 under the hood and the latest tech, a long wheelbase four-door Mustang would surely find many new fans. Combining 480 horses and 415 pound-feet of torque with a spacious sedan body, the Mustang-based Crown Victoria in this render from JLord8 is a great idea just waiting to happen. Now, anytime you mess with an icon, you risk both offending and pleases the masses in equal parts. The render from JLord8 is a full-sized luxury sedan with two major design cues, one from the previous generation, S550, and one from the upcoming generation, S650 Ford Mustang. With a long wheelbase sedan body that seemingly borrows cues from the Genesis G90, the front gets a lightly modified 2024 Mustang face. It also gets a shortened grille size and some minor adjustments to the bumper. All this allows the Fantasy Crown Vic to retain the Mustang's design language while keeping the spirit of what you remember of the police favorite. A large and spacious glass house reveals the intent of the 2024 Mustang-based luxury sedan, comfort first. The rear C pillar is distinctive and unabashed apologetic in its uprightness. Side by side with the Genesis G90, there are some similarities, including the angular rear light that wraps partially around the side. A longer wheelbase and additional weight wouldn't do the 2024 Mustang's handling or speed any good. However, the focus of the Crown Victoria would be, as it always was, comfort and cruising. The 5-liter Coyote's 480 horsepower is much more powerful than the motor in the old Crown Vic, which topped out at 250 horsepower back then for the police versions. In the olden days, it wasn't a Coyote under the hood, but instead the Ford's 4.6-liter modular V8. So who would want a four-door Ford Mustang slash Crown Victoria Frankenstein of a car? Maybe lots of people. But it's probably a moot point since the sedan segment is nearly non-existent and we don't see that changing anytime soon. Right now, JLord 8's rendering is a flight of fancy. And we love it. Thanks for watching another HotCars.com video.